take a deep breath in. Hold. And release. Sisters and brothers, are you an indigo child? Yes, there are fingers being pointed back to me. <laughs> are you an indigo child? I'm an indigo child as well. Well, an indigo child has a mission to complete here on Earth, but a lot of times I'm noticing... Also, what is an angel? A messenger. Demon, messenger. Indigo child. Pretty much a messenger on a mission. <laughs> also known as angels. So, indigo rainbow. Children also. And what, what's the other one? Uh, light. We're, we're light. I'm a light worker, personally, myself. But I notice a pattern. We all have something very similar. We all are empaths. And we all... And I am speaking for a lot of us. Are just love 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 to be loved love to give love and are very smart oh yes very smart but we also share a common trait okay that is very unfortunate but it's a perpetual cycle and it's an ongoing cycle that slows us down from fulfilling our mission and i've obviously in the past if you haven't seen my videos i've revealed some stuff about uh my addiction that was really bad and uh, you know I almost died from addiction but indigo children <laughs> two butterflies check out this cloud indigo children often have addiction issues which slow them down what else do they have what else do we have in common ADD we've been diagnosed with ADD at a young age ADHD and several other things well addiction is a big one and that's one of the things that I see and a lot of angels. And when I refer to angels, I'm referring to a lot of indigo children. Indigos. This, I, not, we're not children anymore. We're indigos. <laughs> and, uh, you know, people call us indigo children because at heart we have a light spirit. And dealing with addiction, it slows us down. And we're very different. We're reckon We have this, a lot of us, I, w I went into the gold soul theory. It's because our souls literally shine we glow when we walk into a room when you walk into a room you probably open up uh people's eyes and people look at you like who is this person and like why does he stand with such a good posture why is he so confident again not every indigo child has the confidence that i have indigo has had the confidence see i had to build my confidence and it takes time and but i also am uh, part of the generation where they say the Indigos first actually started coming out in 1987. True story. So, <clears throat> a lot of light, light beings and Indigos, well, have addiction problems. Now, if you have an addiction problem, how to solve it? Well, see a doctor. A lot of doctors out there uh, deal. And you know, I remember actually, I, I was in a rehab at one point, and... I told this woman something that I never really shared with anybody, and she and she goes, I'm like, so how do you feel about what I said? And it was really strange. It was I explained what an indigo child was, that I'm here from a different planet, on a mission, and she said to me, I've heard it so many times, it doesn't even surprise me anymore. I'm like, what? This is out in Palm Springs, California. And so you need to get treatment get help because alcoholism is consuming alcohol not just alcohol heroin is a big one uh <clears throat> and what's going on is you're self-medicating but why are you self-medicating because i know from experience i did not feel good internally so what did i do i self-medicated now i am on an even an even uh level i feel level-headed finally and it feels really good, I'm not going to deny it, because uh, I fell off balance and off track for a long time. I started self-medicating again. And when I started self-medicating, it was not a good experience. So any indigos out there that are struggling with this addiction, repetitive cycle, there, there's a way to break it. And uh, I'm going to tell you from my experience, see, I know what works for me. As a matter of fact, what works for me, I figured it out when I took when I first took it when I was 16 years old. I was like, "This is this is gonna this is it." I figured it out. I figured it out. The only thing is, I was taking too much of it. Now I take the perfect amount, and I'm able to express myself 
in a way that I, I would not be able to unless I, I were honestly taking this medication. And I want to, you know, give my thanks and praises to the doctors out there that are able, able to help with this. So, shout out to my indigos. You are angels. That's what you are. You are not from, your soul is not from, a lot of our souls are not from this planet. Particularly indigos, indigos and rainbow children, uh... I believe they call them rainbow ch children, right? And light people that call themselves light beings, light workers. The, the, your soul is not from this planet. You made a contract to come here to help ascend the people. And it's it makes perfect sense if we're going, again, if you don't know the time, I'm here to tell you time. Believe in yourself. Why does it make perfect sense? Think about this. We're going, to, we're fun, one, we're seeing things we have never seen. Last time this happened, we saw things we have never seen. World War II is when it, the the first arrival of in recorded history that I know of I'm sure there's I'm sure there are more recorded arrivals of um it's so cool I'm seeing two butterflies chasing each other <laughs> and they're beautiful um arrivals of uh children like-minded children that are just different from the rest and I'm sure there's plenty of times but never really in recorded history on the television did you ever see young women putting flowers in the guns of the soldiers that were holding guns at schools and doing crazy things uh right around the time well right after world war ii which would be in the 70s um right it was right after world war ii i mean this is in the 70s where they call it where the hippies where they're also known as the hippies now what are we we're kind of hippies but at the same time, the music has changed significantly, and a lot of indigos, they, you know, they. I love rap personally, and I will not stop loving rap. That's just what I like because I can hear things that other. Because a lot of artists are indigos, as I always explain, but then addiction comes with it. Now, a lot of times, you are able to get whatever you want. Now, why are you able to acquire whatever you want? Because indigo being an indigo uh has its perks <laughs> you are one you're probably manipulative and two you probably know the right people to get that stuff from and three it's more than likely that you make money being off your talents and if you're making money off your talents well then you have a fan basis and people that appreciate you and that will go out of their way to do things for you so again this is a lot of reason why I believe indigo children go into addiction. And again, it is also self-medication. Uh, I can speak for myself on this one. It's been a tough journey for me. And being on this planet has been super difficult, if you know what I mean. And when I say super difficult, I mean, yes, it's been a difficult time. <laughs> a very difficult time. But, you know... Um, I am succeeding through the right treatment, uh, through the right doctors and it's important for you to find the right doctor as well uh before you hurt yourself or anybody else because uh alcohol is not the answer and there's treatments out there for people like you and there's treatment people like myself we all don't need the same treatment see marijuana works for some people but i i know i don't need to t <laughs> this is no secret all right uh marijuana is being weaponized because now everybody wants to smoke weed because it's legal. Even people who have never smoked weed, so they'll never have the true understanding of uh, what it was, what real marijuana is is like, unless they actually grow it themselves. And even if you grow it yourselves, you're probably uh, using some sort of plant, something that makes the plant grow quicker. And again, this causes more addiction, just like spice. If you don't remember spice. When Spice came out, I could tell you some stories about Spice, man. That shit was dangerous. A lot of people died from smoking Spice. And I remember one time, my friend that passed on, we smoked it together. I thought I was brain dead. I went brain dead for 10 minutes. I couldn't think, didn't know where I was. It was one of the scariest things that's ever happened to me. So, again, they're using chemicals, in my opinion, to weaponize marijuana to slow down indigo children. And I don't think they're doing it specifically just for indigo children, I think they're doing it for the whole population. So be careful with that. Consider growing your own marijuana depending on what state you're in. You're in. Uh, if you have not subscribed to my channel, uh, please do. Take the time out right now. Just hit the subscribe button for some more good content. And uh, I want to say peace be with you also. With you, My thanks and praises to God 
for being able to uh, share my views and and uh, help some people out. Also, my thanks and praises to my mentor, as always. Thank you, mentor. You're the best. I love you, brother. And thanks and praises to my brothers and sisters, and also thanks and praises to the universe. Thanks and praises to Enki and Leo. Thanks and praises to the Rastas, for sure. Brothers and sisters, may peace be with you, also with you. You have a lovely afternoon, and, and blessings will come your way. Just make sure you do it correct, and don't if you're going to fight the system, do it correctly, but don't don't go against the grain too much because it will be a losing battle. It all depends, and this is, I think right now, more important than ever that we all work together as a team, and I'm expressing this because Indigo Children, we are the brilliant, most brilliant people of this world, and we will, and we always will be. Like my mentor says, we always will be, but also, we are, yeah. <laughs> we are us. So brothers and sisters, peace be with you, also with you. I love you guys very much. Again, hit the subscribe button if you have not by now. And uh, yeah, if you have any um, comments, questions, concerns, please hit it in the comments, comment section below. Anything you want me to do a video about, I would appreciate some video suggestions also. And also, you have a great day. Peace.